Good morning, Richmond High. Today is Tuesday, May 26. I'm Annalise Rano, and I'm here to bring you Richmond High Weekly News. We can't believe the school year is finally coming to an end. There is only two more weeks in the 2019 to 2020 school year. Make sure you continue to check Google Classroom, remind, and communicate with your teachers. Remember to 9th through 11th graders, you need to earn a 70% or higher to pass your classes and earn A through G credit. Keep it up Oilers and finish off strong. Seniors, please check the 2020 Google Classroom advisory for some surveys that you need to take. Visit this link to see the surveys. Seniors, please be sure to check your college portals. Many colleges have updated items on your to-do list. Failure to complete those items can result in losing your financial aid or acceptance into the university. There will be CCC workshops this week. The Ed Program Workshop for Seniors is Thursday, May 28th from 10 to 12 p.m. This is a necessary step for the enrollment process and to register for your classes. Visit this link for more information and to register for the workshop. Congratulations to the Swan Scholarship winners, including Javier Garcia, Jennifer Lopez, and Nair Garcia Ceja. Sash pickups are May 28th. Contact your Academy lead for more information. Hey, Willer, so this is my final video as news anchor. Very, very sad. To any future news anchors for Richmond High, my advice, don't take it too seriously. <laughs> like, it's you're gonna feel awkward at times and that's okay. You're gonna mess up sometimes and that's okay. To the students, I don't know what next year is gonna look like for you guys, but do not take anything for granted. I take every day, like, it's your last one at RHS. Like, don't take it for granted. Don't take it for granted because I did that and now I'm sad because I don't have prom. <laughs> I don't have any of my senior stuff. That's all we have for announcements. Coming right up for the last time of the year, take a look at what students are doing to keep themselves busy during the shelter in place.
All right, from the top, here we go. So here I am waking up and I'm putting my hair in a ponytail. Then here I'm going to eat my favorite cereal. Here I'm taking the trash out. Then it's the afternoon and this is what I'm going to eat. Then I'm on my way to work. I just got to work. Now I'm, I'm in my lunch break. And here I just got home and now I have time to do homework. Then my dog was distracting me because he was barking at everyone. And now I start by brushing my teeth. Washing my face. 
and there i'm ready to go to bed <laughs>